Aquarius sign. Um, this is for all of you for the month of July 2020. Uh, how are you, beautiful souls? Now, um, I'm really sorry for the delay also, and I hope that um, this readings will resonate with you. If not, then maybe it will happen in, for the next month, next year, or um, divine timing. <coughs> oh, oh. Uh, or my uh, there's something wrong in my um throat chakra so i keep on talking that's why <laughs> it's been um i only have um one more our uh, readings for the pisces sign now this is um second to the last <laughs> okay let's start uh you might be connected with the capricorn and virgo sign because those are the major signs or major arcanas right here uh, okay, but definitely we have all the signs right here. Uh, okay. Yeah, we have all the signs right here. I think you have you might be connected with um the Capric I know uh with the Capricorn sign because they also have this one, the high priestess, which is they need to work on. So I think um in the month of July uh, Aquarius and you need to work on also in your intuition but here it seems like um um you are already spiritual but you need to emphasize you need to um um you need to work on with this um intuition of uh with this intuition so someone that is higher person that is is guiding you it's watching you but they are not telling you um what to do very silent in the past i can see that someone is coming back someone might be a um someone that is someone that you ha are already married with or someone that you have kids but um but something about a person that has kids um if you are um with a person or something um matter of or if you just wanted to travel be or relocate um, in the past, it seems like it didn't work out. It seems like um, there's a manipulation right here. It seems like there is, um, it you might connect it be with the Ari sign also. It seems like you are, you have this chatmate over here. If you are single, you might have a chatmate in the past, um, but it seems like they are controlling, you no. Know? And 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 you want you don't want to work out with this person. Now you have this three of um three of swords right here. It is a broken heart, but it's in reverse. It's I feel like um you are a uh, trying and and healing up in the month of july you have the energy and you have the um card of successful you are successful financially stag um um stable although um your obstacles right here um aquarius sign is travel if you wanted to travel then it um, this is your obstacle. Maybe uh, there's a lot of conflict in the situation. Maybe there is someone that is going to help you, but it, it didn't. It turn out. It turns out that it, it didn't work out. Um, it didn't work on. Now you also have the Ace of Pentacles, um, which is a big offer. That it might be that the person that is going to help you or is offering you something about business that is very um uh, that is a a big um opportunity abundance this is um victory new something big okay something big yeah and in the present i can see that you are walking away uh, because you feel like um your cups is not um full there is a lot of uh your this a lot of flocking and you also need to rest and stop thinking about things that aren't um working on you wanted to move on 
like what I have said, you are on the healing process, getting out of these swords in your um, heart. But you feel like you're in justice in the situation because you are not listening to your, or you're not um, improving your intuition, you're not listening to your intuition. Now, in your mind or in your attitude or what are you thinking of, you wanted to help um, your friends, you wanted to help your family, uh, somebody that is um, in poverty, but it seems like um, you are juggling for something, it seems like um, your money might be not enough, okay, but you are going to be successful in the month of July, I can see that, yeah. Might be um you are um saving money up um you're saving money for travel that's why um there could be a limitation in helping others. <clears throat> there might be um an Aquarius sign or I might be um same with your sign. This is your sign actually. Now in your family, I can see that um. There's a toxic situation right here. Blocking, no communication, um, stagnation. Uh, you don't know how. Uh, when it comes to your family, there is someone that it that doesn't know how to handle, um, or doesn't know how to save money. Uh, okay. And. There is someone that is very truthful. Uh, there is someone that is making a strategy on how um, to get the amount that you are waiting for. There is also someone that is looking at you or looking at uh, or stalking for someone that is already married, happily married. Okay. Or if you are married, there is someone that is watching over you. Now... Your hopes and fear, um, you're hoping that you can get the answers to your questions, um, whatever it is, if it's, if it is about love life, if it is about, um, pregnancy, if it is about secrets, I can see a secret here, or on an emotional side, an intuition, you are listening, if you are going to listen to your intuition, it might be, um, um, you will know the answers to your, to your, um, questions. Because um, for your hopes and fear here, I can see that something secrets is going to reveal. It might be something about pregnancy. It might be something about that you are pregnant. Or it might be that something about um, it's something about you are being emotional as a mother. Or, or someone is emotional for their mother. Um yeah but i can see that uh, in the month of july i can also see that there is someone new that you are going to um you are going to uh might be someone that is going to love you yes actually it is love actually it's big love someone that you are um this it might be um this is the person that um, you have a crush on the qualities that you you like okay full of love so aside from um ha getting out of this um heartbreak um healing process i can see that there is someone new that it's coming for you in the month of july who is this now, let's see what are your uh, messages from the Goddess Guidance. We have the Istra, Istar, Ishtar um, Goddess. Okay, your message is boundaries. Love yourself enough to say no to others demands in your time and energy. That's why I said um, in your present, you need to um, rest for a while, even though you wanted to walk away, you wanted to, uh, or your persons wanted to walk away, then um, let it be, then, and 
Learn to say no to others. Save your time and energy because there is someone new that is coming. It might also be that this person that is coming is a Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. Um, because um, because you, ha you have um, the cups right here. Or it might be um, those major signs that I mentioned. Aries, Libra, what else? Sagittarius, Virgo, uh, same um, sign, Aquarius. Okay, so that's it for all of you. Thank you for watching. Um, um, what it calls, um, Aquarius sign. I hope you're okay. I hope you're fine. And I hope that you will subscribe. Hit the notification bell and like this video if you like this video. Um, I hope that you will comment down if it it will resonate with you uh, for the divine timing. So, thank you.